Hi and welcome to my video. Before we start, I just want to let you know that the full version of this course is available. So if you are interested in more retouching techniques, make sure you check the links in the description. And now let's jump to the lesson. Using three different retouching tools, we are going to finish cleaning up of this image. At first, I'm going to continue with patch tool because I already started with patch tool. So I just want to show you how to clean up image using three different tools at once, using the knowledge that we learned. So I'm going to quickly sort out the other part of the image. And after that, after I will solve the major issues that I see here, then we are going to switch to some other tools. The clone stamp and healing brush, which will help us to solve all of the small spots that exist on the image. This area that we just entered is the major issue. We had this uh, big spot, so this is a little bit difficult here. And also, I can see we're losing some texture here. It's uh, not the major problem, the loss of the texture here. And also, you need to know after clean up process, this will not be finished. But then uh, we will need to learn some other techniques that will help us to get better and solve the troubling problem. So we'll be talking about things like dodging and burn, how to recover the skin texture, how to smooth skin, how to work with uh, some other retouching techniques as well. So a little bit more here and then I will switch to other tool because these smaller spots can easily be solved with some other tools. So a little bit more here. And once it's sorted, sorted with patch tool, of course, because the skin knot, then I'm going to create another layer. This time would be empty layer, and I'm going to name this clean number two start to with healing brush this time and with healing brush i'm going to sort out the smaller issues and here already starting with this small beard i cannot get fully to the bottom but it's not a problem because with help will come clone stamp but i'm trying to solve the other spots and the reason that we are cleaning up this image with the basic retouching tools is it's because it's often claimed that uh, certain things are impossible to do with basic retouching tools. But what's important for me is to show you that using the basic tools in Photoshop, you can achieve everything. So you don't have to use any fancy techniques, but you just need to master what Photoshop already offers. So even though you don't want to experiment everything and you're getting confused by the work of basic tools, I want to show you how to do it simple and by just using what you have here without Googling too much and getting confused with some layers on the side. So then other side, when it comes to the top under the eyes, as you can see, it's not really trouble in skin, but it's pores. So this area I keep as it is. And then I go down here because here in this highlight, we had quite a lot of spots. So this area need to be cleaned. bit more here and 
I'm keeping for this image rather big size of the healing brush which also causes small loses of texture which is not ideal but it's the best way to work with this image let's have a look I have a lot of discolorations here and at the end I'm switching to clone stamp and I'm trying to solve the edges so we have a lot of spots around the edges irregularities so with clone stamp as you can see how great it works I'm just trying to paint very close to the edge but not directly on it to make the edge straight so when the acne comes out I'm trying to do something like this to straighten this and then I'm going to make it a little bit bigger and paint softly so I can soften the texture and the transitions from this harsh red spots here we will have some trouble but as you can see I can easily cover it with clone stamp and then we have the same problem on the other side first I'm going to do as much as I can here with healing brush the hair inside they're not too difficult to remove and after this I'm going to switch to clone stamp and solve the issues directly on the edge just like this so we solved major issues and now we basically have some discolorations inside so that will be for some other part I'm just going to take care of rest of the spots and that's all we can do having the knowledge from three previous lessons on how the retouching tools works because for now you can see we can keep doing it but the change we are going to apply will not be so drastic as at the beginning when we were removing the big acne so now if we will be keep doing it the change is not as big because the problem now is not acne itself but is this scars this red spots that we have after cleaning up all of the acne so i will have few more spots over here around the neck And this is how you work with these three different tools. Now let's move to next parts to some other techniques. And once we gain some more knowledge, we can come back to the image and solve this kind of issues.